What's going on YouTube? It's your main man Mo back at it with some Mo forms and we back. It's been a minute since I've been in Texas. You know we got the lands over there in Iowa, so had to go ahead and get on down with the get down. Get on back over here to Big Flat, Texas. See what the farm looking like. We left Miles, Phillip, well Phil, and the ladies in the in control of the farm a little bit. We're gonna see what they basically done done and whatnot. We in year three. If you missed the episode, go back, check out the playlist. It's man, it's the whole story driven behind every episode. And I enjoy bringing it to you. You got some funny moments in it. You got some memes in it. Ah, uh, man. Oh, like to me, they done plowed up the cornfield. We did a good soybean field one year. Turned around, did a big cornfield harvest, I should say. The following year, I don't know what I'm going to put in it. This go around just about yet. I don't know what they had in mind to put in it. And here's the farm as we pulling on back up, still looking the same. And why is my big boy sitting out here in the in the wee hours of the day or the morning? Yeah, we got the 94 Sydney RT. I think the only thing that we had at least on the farm is the uh, honeybee header. And uh ooh, we might end up having to come in and do some work immediately pH value for some lime need to be on that field. We might throw some corn in that field. I ain't for sure. I don't know why I'm gonna get in the 94 7 at this I'm tripping. Ha! <laughs> and I wonder why my Wilson trailer sitting there. I'm gonna have to call Miles, Bill, and Bill. All of them. Okay, I see my blue peak sitting up in there. Oh, you got the line spread already hooked up. I remember buying this the old thing right here. <laughs> it ain't gonna do no purposes on the phone, probably just to move that header out. That's about it. Let me go over here and check, it. check on my little equipment in here. See what we got going on. Yeah. Yeah. Boy, that corn harvest. Man, make good money. Good money, good money. But yeah, if you missed out on the Iowa map, it's just a little dreamland. I feel like building a little farm on and run it on how I would normally play a farm without the story behind the farm. A little bit we just kick back relax we might go a little live on it or whatever the case may be maybe possibly hopefully i don't know you tell me comment below <laughs> swing on over here oh oh this is how i feel too hold on i think let me make sure oh uh, yeah this is ours too huh that's where my money been going they could at least call me and tell me that they got some more land that needs some lime on it too. Might come and throw some lime on that field too. Mm, we got about four windmills, as you can clearly see. Oh, they got a uh, black beauty right there. I was looking, I wonder where that truck was. We went in the garage down there. Like they got some grass to cut down here too. Oh, we got some, some limousines down here. Uh, I don't know if they know this door open down here, but I'm gonna go ahead and close it for them while I'm down here. Oh, we got some, some animals, cattle. Got about a good 20 of them. On the wall. Hey, you too. Hey. They see it looking in this garage over here too. I might like a little shunning to get over here, boy. If I boy, they spending my money like that, but I know something. Let's see what they got off of here. Oh, hold on. 
The Thudder 500. The TLX Little Motor Supercharged with the Supercharged V8. Chrome uh, Dot 1100. Blue Doo Doo. I'm going to head back on over here toward the house. Uh. I gotta check this grass too, real quick too. Dude, don't get the fence. That would have been tragic. Uh, yo, yeah, she ready though. She ready. But it's a like forest. I'm gonna get another couple of days and go and get that squared away. I ain't gonna come through and cut it just yet. Cause I could cut this, plot this up. To match that other field, combine these three fields, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because I got that big field back there in the back, too. Let's check that out. Yeah, I got all three of these fields right here. So, mess around and combine all of them. And let's see. Oh, not that. Let's see. Yeah, I can. Yeah. I might go ahead and get a little quick cut off field. Six combines. Five, six, and seven. Shoot, mess around. Let's see, can we get a discount? 39% discount from Samuel. Uh, uh, Y'all think of what I'm thinking? I'm thinking of getting some more land. But, nah, that's 44. Man, nah, I ain't gonna do that to myself. <laughs> ah. Yeah, one big old grab for you. We we'll have silage, hay, and then turn around and plant a little some some minute. Man, get the straw, have so many cows, and then get the uh the bulls to get them a little fattened, get them sold off. We got money coming in both ways, milk and the weight. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna see what we got on that one. I'm gonna see what we got on that one. And park up here on the gray. Boy, it's been a minute since I've been on this map. Let's see what a dog is. Got the little phone call. Let's go ahead and feed wings. We got a little surprise for you. We did some renovation, quick little renovation. Oh, dog here. And I'm still up to debate on putting this corn right here in the home field, but we're going to round over here. I done did a little speed tank, brought the trailer over here, moved a plow by right there. Move the trucks around. Well, the trailer's around. We turned them around, so just in case I need one. And boom, we got two more trucks. We got a W900 Kenwood. Then we got the International 1800. That was a little show truck. Put some deals on that thing. Throw some D's on it. <laughs> oh, and this is the plow from the 9470 RT. Yeah. Looking at the notification I just got. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. And then we. I thought now my phone want to go off. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Then we got the Load King. We basically gonna be running that back and forth, and the other two trucks are just gonna be for, oh, uh, just going to do a quick sale or whatever the case may be. Keep the, keep it rolling and flowing. Then we got a fertilizer tank, a herbicide tank, and then I moved a little depth tank over beside the gas tank over here and made this a little wider area just in case we need to come on over here. Yeah. Let me turn off the auto drive. Oh man. Yeah, I said I'm gonna put corn in it. Might well put corn in it. We got to plant it and roll it and let that thing grow on up. I'm just gonna get everything set up. We ain't gonna do no planting and nothing like that. 
Just gonna get it on out of the way and set it on up over here. Boom, right there, she can get it. And yeah, that field needs some lime too, but let's go take off some cows, shall we? As we arrive, I might come on over and cut the grass. Hopefully I don't mind. Tag along with me. Might do a little quick montage. Oh, that thing right there. Uh, I might end up bringing one of the other trucks over here. Probably the W9. And let that be the, the cattle truck. Since that's a little more old schoolish. I thought I had two more, but no, I know what I had on him now. But it's not even watching, watching. Yeah. He did it. I think I had this on the front and a weight on the back. Oh yeah, I definitely had to wait on the bed. That thing, look at her, look at her, look at her. She's spinning like it ain't nothing. <laughs> oh, she in hell. I'm going to hit and cut all our grass real quick. Well, I might not put the grass, but you, you get the drill. You get the drill. Cow didn't like it. <laughs> and that's how I know. And rub it down to get a eel on. <laughs> yeah, I see it. I'm gonna get in my time oh baby.
quick montage. And the gang get the little small grass field cut over here. Hopefully that didn't take too much of your time. I'm thinking about plowing six and seven. I think them the correct numbers. I'm not sure. I gotta double check that. But the two grass fields, I'm gonna basically combine them together because I had the worker got stuck on the, the cattle fence and I was like, hmm, that might be a, a less shine that we need to take care of in the near future. So that might get taken care of real, 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 real soon. Can't have my workers out here getting stuck, by the way. Uh, it was Sarah at first and another worker had to come in. She got stuck, so she had to go, bye-bye. <laughs> Drop that weight off. I need to get a pressure washer over here. I think I got one. I thought I did. I guess I didn't put one over here. Oh, well, it is what it is and what it's going to be. Turn that off. Mm. Oh, dang. You know what? We got to get the grass off the field, but necessarily, we really ain't got to do it right now. I'm going to head back on over here towards the farm. Because I think I got an idea of... No, I'll take it back. We have to buy a cedar. Because our planter don't plant the little wheat crops. You know, to plant like corn, soybeans, cotton, sunflowers, stuff like that. The the crop that we basically have to plow through or whatever it may be, except in the exception of soybeans that don't have to be plowed. Up. Plus, we only have to fertilize soybeans. That's a good thing. But we definitely gonna have to buy a cedar. Off the truck over here to his house. Put your wings up in the front yard. My boy. Shit. I want to put some lime down, but I need to plow that other field up over there. Matter of fact, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I said I'm going to plow them fields up. And together because we really don't need that grass off that field but at the same time jump up in here let the thing warm up a little bit we really don't like i had said we really don't need that grass but i want to combine both my fields so the workers don't get stuck oh me let's see let's see let's see oh and by the way we don't have a uh a combine, but at the same time, they got one for sale for two hundred and thirty six thousand. That's a seven ninety, but it don't have all the customization on it. And while I'm in that menu, let me check and see. Oh, that's the roller, yeah, sorghum and canola. I need something that's gonna plant like the other little type of crop. Hmm. Well, we'll come over to the shim shim. We might end up leasing it. And we might not plant nothing for real, for real, for those crops. Cows is A-OK. -okay. And we making milk already. So, we good on that part of it. But I am going to collect that grass when I get back over there. Because, might as well get the fields plowed together. And then just send the work off and get them plowed. So we'll get ready for, I guess, late on in the year or something like that. Get um, straw, something like that. I don't know what I want to plant over there. Might end up rocking with some uh, soybeans or something. Oh, I ain't got the other entrance down there. Matter of fact, I got mean, I mean, the thing just spin on the dime. Look at that thing. Ooh! But I see you guys when I get on over there to the phone. Cow phone, it did. 
All right, we over here. We done dropped off the plow to get ready for that little job I done set myself up to do. Go on here and bounce over here and get this uh, wind rope. Get this little amount of sand. Yeah, I messed that up. <laughs> get the little small grass off the field so we can go ahead and take care of that little job. Uh, I might end up doing it myself. Ooh, hope y'all don't get a headache from that. I'm over here moving my head like it's the, uh, the track I are. And by the way, yes, I do have that, by the way, as well. That's going to be coming soon for my ATS fans, my truck fans. Be on the lookout for that. This video should drop sometime today. Or whenever you're seeing it. Go ahead and go to this outside view, turn it on, drop it on. And get the collector. Yeah, I'm thinking about wrapping the field around the, the cattle barn right here because my work bag got stuck right here in this corner right here. If you can't tell, now you, if you didn't know, now you know. And then all this can be the grass field. But I think. They are giving me 125 type crop rotation on it. Well, how good the field is, I'm put it like that, make it sound a little, a little better than what I was trying to explain it is. Yeah. Ooh, that didn't sound too formish. Ooh, I'm over here just making up words now. And I'm currently recording this at 2 30 in the morning. I got me a good nap. Came on in. The game woman came on and knocked it out real quick. Uh, I can say real quick because I've been trying to record this for a good little minute. It probably took me about two days. And like I said, in my like I said in my early videos, I'd be trying to get y'all something to look at, but at the same time, don't nothing really be jumping off. And I hope you guys enjoy the stories that's behind the, the, the series. It ain't take long to get this grass off the field. Well, no way I was standing on the inside view to do this. But that's in the way. And then, uh, I might be able to do that like that. Or just find a certain path to stay on. Swing that thing on around. She gonna collect all this. Better believe that. I want to connect the big field next door to all of them, but I think I'm just gonna rock with this field and that field back there is call it a day. All right, all right. And I just realized I had the hood off. 174 yards of grass. This tractor kind of had just to do a plowing job. I ended up picking the grass up with it because I think the little small tractor in there was going to be Struggling. I'll probably do a little bit in here and then a little section over in here. And voila! Good on! I think I'll put this back in the garage as well. I ain't gonna be over too much longer. Just plow the fields up, get them plowed, call it a day. Ooh. 
we might end up going back to Iowa too. Investments over there and everything. We gotta get stuff taken care of or whatever. Hmm. I will bring it on out towards the road, but then again, it might be doing a little too much. Look back up to this plow over here. We got a good little hefty land over there. We're gonna try to take over that over there on the Iowa map. Yeah, I'm just gonna loop, loop it on around and let that thing be how it be. I really didn't need this big old book of plow, but it is what it is down. Don't you drop down. Now you can drop back and roll and know what it is. Mmm, it's gonna be awful good, but I circle it on one. I ain't had a little small plow. And then again, I'm just gonna do it like these. Hold up, hold up. Might have a little idea. Hold up. Spin that thing on like that. Voila! Man, what am I looking for that one for? Oh, probably my work. <laughs> um, right, well, we might catch it right there. Get the dump inside of you in the lid. Inside of you. Let go across right here. We get them plowed together. You want to make a straight, make the field a little straight line down so the workers won't have a hard time. They won't be swerving all over the place. <laughs> oh, I gave myself hiccups. Got that one. And I'm gonna hire a worker to get the fields and a little taken care. Might make this a little wild. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh, yeah, that definitely gave myself a hiccup. Mmm, they should be able to cut that little small grass that's still in the field right there in the little cut. But yeah, we're going to get this thing plowed on up. You might see it in this episode. You might see it in the next episode. And we're going to get this thing replanted in grass. Take care of these little fields over here so our cattle can be taken care of with some good protein food type-ish. Hopefully. And I'll be catching you guys in the... I don't know why I'm holding this up. Unfold. <laughs> Cause this is gonna be done off cam. So I will be most definitely catching you guys with more Big Flat Texas episode series, however you wanna call it. I'm your main man Mo. We're gonna go work out here in this field and get this thing plowed up. And this video will be dropping soon, so be on the lookout for that. Might do a little quick post on it, I'm not sure. But at the same time, it's on the return back. I know I'm saying this at the end of the video, but this is the return of Big Flat Texas. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe if new. We're on the road to 500. 
subscribers. After that, we're gonna build a road to a thousand. And we're gonna have a live screen map as well. Not this map, but it's just gonna be typically just playing farm film. Just kick back, relax, get to know me, and we can just chat it up. And I'm out. Peace.